Okay, so how do you screen mirror your Samsung Galaxy S7 or S7 Edge to any Samsung Smart TV? It's very, very simple. You guys don't have to pair it or do anything, okay? Simply you do this, okay? You scroll down and then from here, you'll see this down arrow. Click on that down arrow. And then, you know, all the previous galaxies, it would have smart, it would have a uh, screen mirroring in here. However, S7 changes it and they call it Smart View. So click on Smart View. And mine should connect automatically, but you basically have to find it, um, your, your TV and tap on it. But mine's automatic because I just connected to it before this. Also, your first time connected to it, there would be like a message on the top left hand or right hand corner saying, do you want to allow your S7 to connect to this uh, TV? And you just click uh, allow using your remote. And then after you do that, it'll automatically just connect. You won't have to go through that um, through the, uh, message, okay? So we're screen mirroring now, okay? So what can you do with screen mirroring? Well, you can do a lot of things, you know, but you know, don't forget you can also cast stuff too. And I'll show you the difference in a second, but basically your screen mirroring, you can, you know, play games here. I'll, I'll play a game in a second, but let me just go into my gallery here. You can bring people over. You can show them your photos or videos that you have sto stored locally. Like here's a, um, here's a video here. Um, let me show you a photo here. Go, here's a photo here. See, I can uh, zoom in here. Uh, let me do this too. Uh, let me just show you the uh, the camera. Here's my camera. Actually, here, check this out. This is my TV, my Samsung TV I just got. Focus in on there. That's the best bang for the buck. I paid $7.99 for a 65 inch, but it's a 1080p HD, but I have several 4K TVs upstairs, but I can't see a difference. If you sit back more than one foot, you can't tell a difference. So save yourself money, get a 1080, uh, 1080p, you don't need a 4K. Uh, anyways, okay, so let's do this also. Um, let's play a game. Uh, let's see here. Oh, let's play this game here. And I'll show you uh, the difference between screen mirroring and casting in one second too, okay? Because if you can cast, casting should be uh, should take priority over screen mirroring, okay? So let's... Uh... Let's go ahead and play this, and I'll try to move this over so you can pretty much see uh, both screens, okay? See my uh, my phone. And after this, what I'll do is um, I'll go ahead and cast. Uh, you can cast if you have like uh, Netflix. Um, if you want to watch like uh, videos on Netflix or like uh, YouTube or Hulu or uh, like Amazon Video. You're able to cast those apps, okay? If you can cast it, you're better off casting than screen mirroring. Because if you're screen mirroring, you're basically losing like a lot more battery juice, okay? So I think you got the message with this. Let's go ahead and get out of this game. And let's just go to Netflix, okay? So you go to Netflix, and rather than screen mirroring, you're better off casting. And this is a casting icon here, guys. Uh, this this uh, icon right there, and you know, YouTube will have it. There's, there's tons of apps that have it, okay? And I'll show you what you can do with that, but let me just get off the screen mirroring first. And how you exit screen mirroring, you just scroll down, you focus in, click on this down arrow here, and then you just wanna unselect uh, Smart View. Okay, so let's do this now. Instead of screen mirroring um, Netflix, I'm gonna cast, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and click on this casting icon right here. I'm gonna look for my device, it's right here, the Samsung LED 65. And I'm gonna go ahead and press on play here. Now the thing is, like, if I'm screen mirroring Netflix, first of all, it's draining uh, my battery like crazy. Okay. Second of all, I can't do anything else with my phone. Okay. So it basically, if I went to my home screen, then my TV, my HD TV, will go in the home screen as well. You know, if I um, uh, make my display um, sleep, then it's, it's going to be black on my HD TV. However, if I'm casting. I can continue to run this, let me push play. I can continue to run uh, Netflix in the background 
while I go back into my phone and I can look at different, uh, I can go into different apps, I can, um, I can make phone calls, I can, I can send text messages. So if you can cast, it's so much more convenient than, um, oops, okay. I need to, uh, uh, all right. All right, just give it a second to uh, load here. And I'll, I'll show you what I'm talking about, okay. So here I'm playing uh, Special Correspondence. And now if, if I was screen mirroring and if I went to my home page, my home screen here, you will see that on the TV. Now you can see that this, let me focus in on here, this is totally still playing in the background. Look at this, I can even turn my phone off like that, it's still playing in the background. I can make phone calls now, I can even send text messages. So it's a lot more um, features, more benefits involved if you're able to cast it rather than screen mirroring. But of course, you can't screen mirror like, uh, like most of the games. You can't screen mirror your, your photos and your videos, you know, stored locally. So, Anyways, that's pretty much it. If you guys have any questions or anything, just comment below. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.